Alright boys, we just got like one of the biggest updates for Roblox Funky Friday. I mean, we ended up getting the Indie Cross update just a couple moments ago. We are going to go over every single new update and feature that we're going to be getting in this one. So make sure you smash the like and subscribe. I do cover every single update for Funky Friday. And of course, let's dive right into it. Of course, we're going to dive into all these new animations right here. We ended up getting 10 new animations along with one updated one it's gonna take a while but let's get right into it of course we do have our cheapest newest animation it is going to be ron bloodshed for 550 points so this is what the animation looks like on idle you got left down up and then right as well i mean honestly it does look really cool not gonna lie this is what it looks like with some gameplay though I mean, it is the most cheapest animation from the update out of like 10 other animations. Honestly, it is a pretty good animation to begin with. Our next one is going to be the Cuphead animation. This one's going to be worth 600 points. This is what this one looks like on idle. You're kind of like jittering around left, down, up, and then right as well. Very funky looking. I'm not going to lie about that one. Oh, uh, I'm not sure if that's how Cuphead's animation is supposed to look like, to be honest. It's very buggy, in my opinion. I'm just being honest here. Next up, we do got the new Sky animation for 600 points as well. This is what this one's gonna look like on Idol. We've seen it in the leak video. Left, down, up, and then right as well. Nice. I definitely like that one a lot, especially because of how smooth the animation is in between the frames. Like, you gotta play with that setting on, especially if you want to make the most out of it. Next up, we do got another Sky animation, this time Sky Blue, for 600 points as well. And this is how this one looks like on idle, left, down, up, and then right as well. I really like the poses in this one. Here we go. Again, another very flawless, smooth animation. It definitely fits Sky pretty well, especially in that different version right there. This time we're going into the Mario universe with the I Hate You Luigi animation for 650 points. And this is what this one looks like on idle. Pretty cool. Left, down, up, and then right as well. <laughs> another funky looking one. Look at that one. That looks cool. That one's really cool. I definitely like that one too. I think the best pose on that animation is definitely going to be the down pose. <laughs> you know, it, it, it just looks really funny, honestly. Next up, we got MX for 700 points. This is what this one looks like on idle. You kind of just like, I don't know, you just go to the beat. Left, down, up, and then right as well. Look at that up arrow. <laughs> that looks very evil. I think Funky Fry is definitely trying out some more animations to have like those jittery effects to the animation. Like that one's a prime example of that and honestly, very nice too. Next up we do got the regular old Sky animation back again, 750 points. Flippin' Telegator moment! But yeah, no, at the moment the Sky animation's broken, but this is how it looks like in the past, so I think it is going to be the same animation comparing it to the past, so there you guys have it. That's how it's going to look like, hopefully, when they do fix that animation. Next up, we do got the Sammy animation, which is going to cost you 950 points as well. This is what this animation looks like on idle. You're wielding an axe, left, down, up, and then right as well. Hey, there we go. That looks cool too, man. I like how you're able to like twirl the axe with the right hand whenever you press the right input. It just adds a little bit of flair to the animation, to be honest. Next up, we do got the sink animation. It's gonna be 1,250 points. I guess we're going back to the bathroom or something like that. This is what the animation looks like on idle. It is gonna be the mine attachment one. Left, down, up, and then right as well. Dang. Oh. 
All right, when it said sink, I thought it was the bathroom sink, but actually this animation does look really good, especially since it did came from the leak video. And then we also do have the dark load animation as well for the same amount of points. This is how this one's gonna look like an idol. I'm not sure what that is to be honest. Left, down, up, and then right as well. Bro, you got like window pop-ups over there. That's really cool, man. Dang. It's like you're in charge of a computer virus or something like that. You're able to spawn up window pop-ups during your inputs, which is absolutely insane. We also do have the hex detected animation, which did got updated. This is what the new animation looks like on idle. Left, down, up, and then right as well. Not bad, it looks a lot better. As for new maps, we do have a couple new ones. First, including Arcade V2, which is going to be an updated version of Campy's Arcade. This one looks really cool. You got like a super scuffle sign in the back over there too with a lot more cameos as well. We also ended up getting the Dave map as well. We saw this as a leak a long while ago, but it's finally in Funky Friday. Very nicely done too um, as well. Next up, we do have the Judgment Hall map as well from the Andy Cross Monogut Sand. And this one we saw a leak of just a couple minutes before the update actually looks really cool too This one we got the forgotten fortress map background also from the Mario Madness mod too And honestly this one is very well made even got a fire floor on the bottom of it too Which just adds even more depth to the whole map and then for our last map background We do have the unloaded showdown background too not 100% sure what mod this is from We do have a little ice cream shop called you cream which is funnily enough. But other than that, it looks like we're just in a deserted alleyway, which does look pretty spooky. So as it says on the What's New board, we do have added death and poison note customization. So what we have to do is we have to go up to the UI menu button right over here. And if we go over to the new notes tab in the menu, here we can do death note customization. And also poison note customization too, in which we can see those hazard notes just like from a couple of videos ago. Heck, we actually got a lot more notes to go through on this one too such as inverted outline arrows and also just like inverted arrows and obviously you do have the hazard notes too over here you do have the override mod style toggle so if you have this on it is going to override the selected style for the mod but other than that the system is pretty simple to use you can just select which type of death note or and or poison notes that you would like to go with and also we didn't get any bosses or any major things like that but we are going to jump into a public server in order to try out a couple of the new songs here we go Oh boy, here we go boys! Nightmare Run! Just like for the leak video, we are gonna be experimenting with some of these death notes and poison notes from the mod as well. There they are right there! The ink notes! You do not want to hit any of those black notes, otherwise it is going to ink your screen. It's pretty insane, I know. But here we go. <laughs> oh my gosh. It is like so nerd knocking dude. I'm telling you bro. Oh my god, here we go! We just hit one! Now you can hit any, you can hit as many notes as you want, and it won't like oop you. You do, you just gotta watch out for the other notes later on in the song, which are gonna be the static notes. These notes right here are definitely not gonna be good, bro. It gets, it actually gets even worse right here. Look at that. Like what the heck's going on here, dude? Oh my gosh, dude. Now you get the static notes right here too, bro. This sounds just otherworldly, dude. I'm surprised Funky Friday was able to like add in all of these notes in, man. That's freaking crazy. And there you go. If you hit a static note, you literally just oof right there too, man. Like, oh my gosh, dude. All right, that was a little bit too chaotic right there. We are going to be trying out last field this time. Hopefully things are a lot more uh, easier. I mean, there might be even more notes in this one too, though. Uh, yeah, there is. Oh my gosh. Look at our opponent. Go, oh, man. It's going off right here, man. Oh my gosh. Man, dude, this mod is literally insane, especially when it comes to mechanics and everything like that. Here we go, man. I'm pretty sure most of the songs from the Indie Cross mod in Funky Friday has mechanics. Now, I'm not sure if they have, like, the Undertale mechanics, just, like, from Sand, like, you have a little battle going on. But it would be pretty cool to see that actually come into Funky Friday, though. Like, that would be insane. And, of course, we do got two buffoons slapping at each other over the speakers, too. Quite the slap battle indeed right there, but here we go, man. We got this in the bag right here. Jeez. Look at all those ink notes right there. Oh my gosh. If you hit one, 
You're a goner. Honestly, if you just say one ink note, you are a goner right there, man. You just gotta be very cautious when it, when it comes to those notes. My opponent does have a slight lead at this point. We gotta try and catch up to him if possible, though. But yeah, it's really cool to see Funky Friday experimenting with even more death notes and even more, like, poison notes, too. Like, other more game mechanics in the game, too. It's really cool to see that happen. Makes you wonder what they're gonna be adding in next in the future. I know, right? Like, it's pretty crazy. Here we go, the static notes right here, too, boys. Oh, boy. Oh, wait, who ended up hitting it? I, I ended up hitting it, bro. I freaking stink with static notes, huh? All right, this time I'm gonna try Golden Land from the Mario Madness mod. Now, this one definitely is a throwback, especially to like the six golden coins. I'm not sure if any of you guys remember that Super Mario Land 2 game for the Game Boy. I definitely grew up with that one. This is like nostalgic right here, man. Oh my God, dude. If any of you guys grew up with this game, let me know in the comments. Like, it's gonna be pretty interesting to see how many people know about this song. Very slow beginning though, I'm not gonna lie about that. Oh. Oh, oh, it's gonna get hard right here, I can tell. Here we go! <laughs> Bro, it just like turned the Nile right there, man. It literally turned the dial to the max right here. Oh my gosh. This song's definitely crazy, man. I'm telling you that much, bro. It's definitely fast. Like, that intro right there really got me. I thought it was gonna be a pretty slow song, but it actually honestly catches you on guard. Like, honestly, it just catches you off guard, to be honest. Here we go, man. We're gonna be able to beat him. Last moments right here. We got the slight lead right here, though. Oh, man. <laughs> Bro. Now, that's a match right there, ladies and gentlemen. But, yeah, honestly, really big update. Hopefully, you guys do enjoy it. Make sure you smash the like and subscribe. I cover every single update for Funky Friday. Use Star Code Attack. We'll see you guys on the next one.